That's great. Uh, does anybody want to volunteer and tell me something about what you guys did? Anybody? Yeah? So, um, I was actually head of a council. Uh, it was called Outreach and Environment Council. So it was uh, in the social work. I'm from India, by the way. Uh -huh. So um, we 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 um, took actually took a trip where this 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 <coughs> river called the Yamuna River in India. It's a sacred river. So uh, we took an entire trip and we saw um, the river slowly getting polluted as it reached um, the cities. Um, we found that um, one of the greatest, one of the most. Um, Polluting things, I'd say, uh, within the river was uh, was polythene bags. So to cut a long story short, uh, we got financing from the Indian government to start production of cloth bags and um, <coughs> distribute it among schools in Delhi, and which was further distributed um, in local stores by students in the school. Okay. So you got money from the government. Um, we we don't get money from the government. <laughs> I, I did that over the summer. That was a, for a company, but so we we get money from different sources, which I'll explain to you guys. So um, let's like, start off by telling you guys exactly what we do and why we do what we do as um, a SOBI finance division. By the way, um, as any other volunteer, when you hear the word finance, what's the first thing you think about? Money, right? Well, we are in the business school, right? But uh, the point is, we directly um, have this connection between finance and money. And there's a reason why we have that connection, because money is at the heart of a lot of the stuff that we do. Um, some may ask, you know, we need money to make accounting, we need money to do research and development, it's called R&D, we need money to buy assets, we need money to create a lot of the stuff that we do. Without money, we could not have gotten a room for 42 BC. Without money, we could not have done the marketing that we did. Without money, there's a lot of stuff that we can't do. Of course, there are also those of us um, like me who dislike money. But um, <laughs> second to that. <laughs> so, we need money in order to run as an organization. But you know, money does not fall from trees, right? We have to get it from sources. You know, the university, corporate places, the government. Maybe you can contact the Indian government for us. But I can't do that. So how do we do it? Um, how did you? Do it? Um, so there's there's an environment wing with the production. I contacted them, um, presented my idea to them. Um, thankfully, it was. Um, I mean, they agreed. <laughs> So they gave us a certain amount of money, which was um, we had to we had to again negotiate with um, with a factory for us to produce the bags. Yeah, negotiate is something that you definitely have to do. Um, on at UFM, there is no like administration smiley face that we just talk to them and they can support us. We have to go to individual organizations and specific companies to search for those money and. Uh, a recent event that I just did is I went to the Center for Entrepreneurship. Um, maybe some of you have heard that, and I got a thousand dollars from Doug Neal, one of the leaders there, to work on a project. But um, and there are certain tech tactics and techniques that you all learn if you want to do finance, which I'll explain soon. Um, by the way, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Chen, and uh, I'm a sophomore. I'm doing industrial and operations engineering with business. I was doing double E, and then I broke Anthony's heart. <coughs> did I O E instead, which I think is the right choice. But in any case, so how do we do it here at Sobi? Well, uh, we actually split it up into two sources. There's an internal source of revenue and there's an external source of revenue. Internally, we have a much more personal connection with different organizations like the Center for Entrepreneurship, Empower, and all sorts of different other clubs that can provide money to clubs like us in order for us to fund our ventures. At the same time, we produce partnership. And uh, last year during 42 BC, we partnered with um, Empower to get members here. I was actually originally from Empower uh, to get members here to work on the same goals. And from that perspective, money is actually not the biggest thing that we want because, um, frankly speaking, those organizations cannot produce huge sums of money for us. Um, but they can produce partnership, which can create fantastic opportunities, get people to come to our organization, get people to come to our uh, individual events, and sometimes. From a monetary perspective, and from a financial perspective, and from like an investing perspective, that's actually worth more than the raw money by itself. But on the other side of money, we have a much more external source, right? And we mentioned Pepsi, we mentioned Sobi, which we really want to get this year, and we mentioned all the, those other companies. Now, you might think, why as a company would they give us money? Well, that's the whole point of financing, that's the whole point of talking to them, showing them what we do, and making them believe in our vision in order for them to supply us with capital. But the way that we approach them is completely different. I'm sure um, this is also very different from your government experience. But we're much more professional to them. 
we, we have previous individual signed testimonies, create testimonies, and to show them that we have produced significant results and that it is worth your time and money to give us and to help us fund. At the same time, we also consult with them to ask exactly what their needs are as a company and how they can, how we can help their image in our organization. And we have very, very standardized sets of rules and we definitely differentiate from all the other organizations because, because trust me, uh, if we're asking for Pepsi for money, uh, you think all the other organizations are? Yeah, they are. And those companies know we want money, so you have to differentiate in order to survive. And that is something that you will learn as you are working on uh, finance, which is actually very, very um, <coughs> in view with what. But money is a key word, and this year we're going to focus a lot on the external resources because that is where it is really at. All right. So now that you have an idea about uh, how we do it, right? We want to. Why we do it? We need a, we need money in order to operate. How we do it? We have internal and external resources. But now, what do we create? All right. So what we have created is that we need we have created specific sets of rules of how we approach these companies and these external and internal clubs. When you decide to work with us on the financing side, you'll be doing all sorts of stuff in the uh, capitalized words that I listed here. You'll create standardized reports to show to these companies. You'll create endorsement packages in order for them to understand exactly what level of funding is required for them to attain the results that they want, right? And to help us attain the similar re results that you want. And at the same time, you'll do a lot of data compiling because money, uh, because money itself is a form of data, and you have to compile your own data to show them that with this many viewers, with this many direct viewers, with this many people interested in Pepsi, with this many people interested in drinks, with this drinks that we um, that we uh, put on at 42 BC you as a company is, is, uh, should give us money, right? So financing is a huge thing that has all sorts of different fields, all sorts of different activities, um, but it's very, very big, and currently uh, there's not that many people working on it, so if you're interested in it, definitely consider. And this year, we want to make it to the 10,000 level. Last year, we got $5,000, but this year, like I said before, we want to get more external resources to make that $10,000. If you want to be part of that, definitely think about it. So. All this stuff. Think about where you are and what you want to do. And if you think that financing is right for you and Sobe fits your vision, definitely come afterwards and talk to me. And uh, we can also discuss about whatever other things you like, including how this cool presentation was made. All right. Well, thanks. I'm